Let us state the Pythagorean theorem. All right, the Pythagorean theorem is an if-then statement. So we have if and then, meaning that it is conditional. If, for example, if we have... Well, by the way, I'm recording this, so... If we have a right triangle, then a squared plus b squared equals the c squared, where c is the hypotenuse. All right, well, if that is the Pythagorean theorem, then the converse also is a conditional if-then statement. But we're going to switch those around. So if a squared plus b squared equals the hypotenuse c squared, then we have a right triangle. All right, what are the names of three sides of a right triangle? So if this is a right triangle, right here, the two sides that make up the right angle are called Lex. Lex? Yeah, like Lex Luthor. So there's two Lex. We could say Lex number one and Lex number two. And then the longest side, which does not make up the right angle, is the hypotenuse. I guess that makes sense, sure. So we could say that this is A and this is B, not that either of those really matter. And then the hypotenuse is a C. And when we sum the square of the two lex, then it gives us the hypotenuse squared.